Next, we're in San Luis Obispo, California, where even though court is in recess, things are heating up between opposing counsel. On one side is Timothy McGill, whose client, a state hospital employee, is suing for wrongful termination. And on the other end of the table is the state's second highest ranking legal officer, Deputy Attorney General Jenny Mariah Kelly. Moments earlier, during cross-examination of a state witness, McGill asked the witness if she had met Kelly earlier in the day, prior to testimony. This particular question, an effort to potentially cast doubt on the witness's credibility, angers Kelly. And now she's letting everyone know. Gesturing wildly and reportedly raising her voice, bailiff Tyler Brooks approaches Kelly and tells her to stop shouting and then asks her to leave the courtroom. But based on Kelly's body language, it appears she's not interested in going anywhere. And now here's something you don't see every day. A state's deputy attorney general about to be escorted out of court. If only it ended there. According to the sheriff's report, after Kelly refuses to lower her voice or leave the courtroom, the bailiff then grabs her hands to escort her out. But when she pulls away, the bailiff wrestles her to the floor. As Kelly's co-counsel looks on in disbelief, other deputies arrive and help handcuff Kelly as she continues to resist. Once on her feet, a few more words are exchanged before she's finally escorted out of the courtroom. The California Deputy Attorney General was charged with resisting a peace officer, but later pled no contest to the lesser charge of disturbing the peace. She was also ordered to pay a $1,000 fine and complete anger management classes. Thanks for being a fan of CourtCam. Subscribe to a and &E to never miss a new video and catch full episodes on AETV.com.